Hey YouTube and welcome back to It's Amazing. If you're new to my channel, hello, how are you? And if you're an old subscriber, welcome back Terry, like we've missed you. So before we get into this video, you see the red button, make it gray and subscribe to my channel and hit the bell notification so you'll be uploaded. So you'll be updated every time I upload and you won't miss a second of this chocolate base. And follow me on my social media accounts, which will be floating up there just for you. And yeah, I'm ready to do my hair. So let's get into the video, Terry. I do my hair toss, check my nails. Baby, how you feeling? Hair toss, check my nails. Baby, how you feeling? So today I'm going to be doing a twist out, but Instead of just doing a twist out, I'm also going to be doing a hairstyle. So I feel like I never do hairstyles. I really just do twist outs and just untwist it. So I'm going to do a hairstyle today. And I am going to be trying out this new product that I just bought. It is called the Auntie Jackie's Curl Lala. And it's a defining curl, course, curl custard. And it was really cheap on Amazon, so I bought it. And here it is. And if you want to know, like, know where I got this from, and I will have the link in the description box, and you can just click it and purchase it if you want to, and you know, help pay for this tuition. So yeah, we're just gonna see how that works. So I'm gonna start by flat twisting this section up here, and all I did was went from ear to ear, and I made a somewhat straight part. You can call that straight. I didn't go too far back because I wanted my hair at the back to be bigger. So, I mean, I just, you know, got a little nice size chunk. So, yeah, we're just going to be flat twisting that. So, I am going to be nice to her for a minute. I'm going to put some water on her just because she, you know, she's not dry dry, but she's dry. So, I'm going to spray a little bit, just a little bit of water and go from there. Okay, so now that it's damp, I'm going to be using my leave-in by Be Nice Essentials and the moisturizing and sealing cream from them as well. And I have a video on those products. If you want to go watch it, click the link and just, you know, watch it. And I'm also going to be getting some oil. This is just olive oil and Jamaican black castor oil and just, you know, sealing in the moisture with that. Now she has all moisturized and stuff. I'm trying to see, do I want to put this on this? Nah, I'll just wait to the back. Ooh. Hold on, hold on baby. So now all I'm going to be doing is just flat twisting this section going this way and just, you know, going all the way down there. And this is not a flat twist tutorial. So if you're trying to learn how to flat twist, you have come to the wrong place. Okay, so this is my flat twist, and this is, you know, <laughs> my, I don't, okay, yeah, it's just gonna lay down like this for now. Okay, so now we're gonna work with this, and this is just an old twist out, so, yeah, she's kind of dry, she's like somewhat neglected, but not all the way, because I've been putting my bonnet on, so I'm just going to basically do the same steps that I did with the flat twist, but... I'm going to be incorporating this bad boy in there too just to you know make things get into formation even more because it is a defining curl cluster so it's supposed to you know enhance your curl so I'm excited about this and I hope it works because I won't have to use a gel when I want to you know revamp my twist out let's see how this works so I'm gonna start from the front I'm gonna do smaller twists at the front so you know the front can look more defined and I'm gonna do larger twists at the back so you know it can be full and big so it says you can use on wet or dry hair and I'm gonna somewhat dampen it you know give a little life to her now that it's damp I'm gonna finger detangle just you know slightly so my twists can come out very defined I know y'all saw that little hair fall out see Terry I don't know what's wrong with my hair I want to know if these two products mix well so I'm going to like mix it in my hand first before I put it on my hair because one thing I found out about this product here like she doesn't mix with a lot of stuff I tried to mix it with my texture ID it did not work and I'm really sad because I really like this stuff so upon opening this I'm a 
very smelly person. That did not come out right. I am scent sensitive. We're gonna go with that. I'm scent sensitive. And this, it doesn't smell like, this smells like something you would mop with, to be honest. It doesn't stink, but like I wouldn't picture that for my hair. Like, you know what I'm saying? On a scale of one to thick, like she is like, it's not thin though. It's like medium. It ain't thick, but it ain't thin either. So that's that on that. <laughs> and now I'm just gonna mix this too so I have my, you know, leave-in that I live by and I have the curl a lot. I'm just gonna mix it in and just see what happens on my hand. <laughs> oh yeah, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. Look at that. See what you don't want is for it to get frothy and like bumpy and stuff but this is just smooth see yeah that's what I want okay so right off the bat I can really tell this is gonna be moisturizing because my hair shrank shrunk shrank one of those so I'm just gonna get a little bit of that oil blend I had I'm just gonna put that on the section as well just to seal in the moisture that we have so yeah this is what I'm working with and now I'm just going to you know you know how to do a twist out separate the section in half and you know I have my two sections and to make sure I get the most definition I am going to like I'm twist my hair but at the same time rotate the hair in the direction that I'm twisting just to you know seal in that definition that I want so I'm just gonna twist like that you just twist and twirl twist and twirl twist and twirl and I'm just gonna do that till I get to the end of the section I'm also applying some more of my leave-in at the end just so when I brush it out I can get a nice coil at the end so you know so my twist will stay intact throughout the night while it's drying. And we're just gonna coil it in with our finger. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Woo! Um, yeah, <laughs> so yeah, that's the coil. And this is the first twist. It's looking real juicy, real moisturized. So far, so good though. I'm gonna twist up the rest of my hair doing the same thing. I'm going to be getting leave-in first, then applying the curl la la, and then sealing all of that moisture in with a good old oil blend and then finger detangling and twisting and applying more to the ends. So all of the twists are in and they look real juicy. So now I'm just gonna get, you know, some more oil cause you can never be too safe. I'm just gonna let these dry and I'll come back tomorrow with the results and my final thoughts on the product. The next day. Good morning. Tayo, the bears, a chirpin. Okay, so it is the next morning and I do not know well it's, okay it's not morning it's actually 12 o'clock but that is none of your business so I am here today what am I doing so I am back and we're about to take these twists out I let them sit all night and marinate and you know shrink 
So we're about to just see what we're about to get because I'm excited. I feel like this is going to be a very good twist out. And if it is, I'm going to change clothes <laughs> and put on a lip gloss. Okay. Okay. If it's too bright, I'm sorry. I'm just trying to get this together with the background and the lights and trying to get, trying to get my life together. But I found my scrunchie, so that's a start. So now I'm just going to put my hair up and we're going to start taking down these twists. I'm just going to get some oil. This is just olive oil and Jamaican black castor oil like always. I'm going to put it on my fingertips. I'm just going to take it and open it. I don't like how that end turned out, but we're just going to ignore that. But let's just get into this definition right here. Right here. Defa who? Definition. Definition. So they're defined. So I'm just going to, you know start taking them down one by one you know the drill just take them down be careful even though I'm probably not I'm probably gonna create a lot of frizz it's okay it's okay just reinforce it as best you can and keep on moving like we're just gonna take this one twist out at a time halfway done and what we're not gonna do is act like we don't see the definition like I know y'all see it I know y'all see it you can take this to the bank baby I'm so and then just imagine when I stretch it and I like how like you know the back is fluffier the front is more defined giving me the illusion of fluffier hair when I haven't even picked or stretched it like y'all y'all need to wake up Okay, so I'm going to come back when my hair is all the way taken down, and I will show you what I have. I'm not so here's my hair all taken down. I have not stretched it or anything, and I need to say it again, because I know y'all see it. We're not going to act like we don't. We see the curls popping. We see... Did y'all see that? I'm going to do it in slow motion. Wait. So, do I even need to stretch it? Yeah, I'm going to stretch it just to be extra, just to make it more extra special i'm just gonna stretch it real quick with a blow dryer normally i would not condone using a blow dryer but i really don't feel like stretching my hair with the african thread like i normally do because it takes longer so you know i'm just gonna stretch this right quick and i will be right back with this masterpiece like and hopefully i don't mess them up like you see the curls before i stretch it you see the curls right you see them you see the definition right because what we not gonna do yeah i saw it See, I wasn't planning on doing all this, but my hair turned out great, so I had to. So, um, all I did was pin the, you know, the twist was right there. I just pinned it to the back. Nothing special, just pin it. Really don't have to if you don't want to, but I feel like it makes the front better, so I did it. And now I'm going to put on lip gloss. I didn't even do my edges. Like, that's how much, that's how you know I like this hairstyle, because I didn't even do my edges. So I take that back. I did do my edges. And like, <laughs> y'all ain't gotta say it. I know I look cute. Like, you see, why is my shirt not wanting me to be great though? That's the only thing that's gonna mess up my attitude right now. So, like, you see the hair. So let's get into the product review because the hair speaks for itself, to be honest. So, on Jackie's curl a lot. On a scale of one to ten, no one to five. I don't feel like going all up there. One to five, I give this a four would have had a solid five had it smelled like tropical rainbows but it didn't but we're like it's okay though it's okay it doesn't stink it's just you know a wall plug never hurt anybody but that's okay that's okay besides the point point. and the fact that i only paid four dollars for her i think it was 480 something four dollars and 80 something cent y'all go buy this because <laughs> my hair looks how it would look if i would have used a gel but it's softer and that's the good part and it's moisturized like my hair is soft and moisturized and bouncy and just 
beautiful, easy, beautiful, easy, breezy, beautiful. So that is the end of this video, and I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, do not forget it. If you did, do not forget to give it a big thumbs up and comment, like, and subscribe so you will not miss a second of this chocolate face. And hit the bell notification when you subscribe so you'll be notified every time I post. And follow me on my social media accounts, which will be floating up there just for you. And have a hot girl summer. Like. Bye.